It says I'm overheating, but it's not hot at all. You know, I think I might have messed up the sensor on the radiator. When I get home, I'm gonna take that apart and redo it. Cause there's no way I'm overheating. There's no heat on my leg. Like I can physically feel that the radiator that I just put in works. I did get a new sensor. I should install that. I installed the old sensor. I hate riding it here. That part is so scary. You don't know how scary that was. I was just talking so I didn't shit myself. This angle, you gotta go fast on this part. I don't wanna go fast, I'm so high up. Like, I'm kicking the brakes, this part is scary. When I do go riding here at nighttime for camping, I'm not bringing the quads. We're leaving the quads at camp, and then we're taking, uh, we're walking up here. There's no way we're riding. But my, my astronomy teacher, Mr. Ziegler, showed us a website. Shout out Mr. Ziegler, you're the man. I doubt you watch this anyway. Um, as I was saying, he showed us this website called Stellarium where you put your coordinates in the computer and it shows you all the constellations around you, all the planets around you, and you can see it very nicely at nighttime. And there's the compass in there that shows you which way you're looking. It's cool. Not sponsored by Stellarium. I wish I was sponsored. Ender Framing, if you want to sponsor me, go ahead. Speaking of sponsors, I had some viewers ask me if they could do like a montage of my riding videos because I have some viewers that are really good with like cameras and editing pictures and videos and I had one ask me if it was okay if he made a montage of me riding around and just DM me on Instagram with your montage and you're all set you can make one however you like just DM it to me I'll put in my video and give you credit Longer than 0.75 miles, I was mistaken. I'm gonna face my fears with this park again, or this track. But I finally did do a full circle on the whole entire track in one video.
sometimes I like to ride is to like push off the bars or pull onto them like pull the bars but also pull yourself back like try to move yourself onto the bars while pulling yourself back I don't know for me I feel like I'm like well seated when I do that instead of just normally just being loose on here and then got it nice and tight showed you guys this way. Here's the other half of the trail. So you got this little road over here that leads to another road, Sullivan Trail. It still leads to Sullivan Trail. Here's this big pond. I'm pretty sure this place used to be a lake or something. This is way more full than last time. Last time, you still had space. There's fish in here. I kind of want to do a fishing video. There's fish, tadpoles, snoots, a lot of cool amphibians to catch. I kind of want to catch a newt and keep it in my aquarium. Or just do some fishing out here. Let me know in the comments below if you guys want a fishing video. But that's a good for them to be tight. Oh. It's good for them to be tight. The, the overheating sign went away. It is probably the... It is probably the sensor that's messed up and I still have to replace. I have the sensor sitting in my parts box, so I'll put that in. Pro tip, when there's a hill going down that's kind of bumpy and you're kind of scared of going on it, just speed up on it, unless it's like a really scary hill, and just don't even go on it at all. If I didn't stop at the top of that hill in my last video, I would have never had to buy all these parts and fix them. Well, I still kind of had to buy most of the parts, but not the steering stem. That part. That I still have to replace. There's so much in the way of steering stems, that's crazy. Oh, let me crack my back while I'm here. Okay. dead fish. There's the dead fish. I want to ride up there. I saw a passageway that you can get up there. It doesn't look like there's anything cool up there, but you gotta ride it wherever you can. I really did not miss about riding quads is the sore thumb you get after riding for a couple hours. Alright guys, thank you for watching that video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really enjoyed making it. I miss riding my quad so much. Here's the scooter I'm always talking about. It's a little junk piece of scooter I built in less than a hundred bucks, but it's, it's still a scooter. I ride it. It needs an exhaust. But anyway, back to the quad. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm close to 30 subscribers. I'm at 25. And if you really did enjoy it, share with your friends and turn on post notifications. Leave a nice comment, and as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good day. Peace.